It's already six in the morning. Today's my birthday, you know. I'm 13. <laughs> schnell, schnell, los! Geh rauf auf den Lastwagen. Schnell, auf was wartest du? God, would you please give this to Anne? It's a little present for her birthday. I do hope she likes it. And this is from me, Otto. Thank you, Copois. Thank you, me. I'll give them to her at home. As I told you, we will soon be going into hiding. Would you be willing to assume the risk of looking after us and being our outside contact? Yes, of course. We'll be needing you very soon. I'm home. Daddy? Daddy, it's you! <laughs> oh, you brought home lots of surprises, I'm sure. Let me see them. Let me see them. <laughs> A little patience, Anne. I'll give you Meep and Copois's gifts in the meantime. Oh, yes, please. Take my case. Yes, Daddy. Thank you. Let's go inside now. Hello. Daddy, you're back at last. Thank heaven you're home safe. <laughs> How are you, Edith? Did you have a pleasant day, dear? Can I open my presents now, please, Daddy? Can I, please? Happy birthday, dearest Anne. Here, these are for you. Oh, thank you. The one with the pretty ribbon on it is from Meep. And open your presents carefully. If not, you'll spoil this lovely paper and the ribbon. Everything is so very precious during wartime. Yes, I know. A book on the cinema. It's Greta Garbo and and Fred Astaire. Oh, I really adore them. And my dear, you should look at the package underneath it. Hmm. Oh, it's a dream come true. A diary. Wonderful idea. Thank you, Daddy. <laughs> it's from your mother as well. We both had the same idea. Don't you think you should thank her too? Oh, I'm sorry. Thank you, Mummy. Take advantage of your carefree life while there's still time. Otto, I'm frightened. We were forced to leave Germany because of Hitler, and now they're making us wear yellow stars on our clothing in Holland. Yes, I know. The only way to escape the Nazis now is to hide from them, to disappear. What will become of us? This horrible war has me so worried for Anne and Margot. Edith, listen. 
You know as well as I do that it's too late and too dangerous for us to try to get out of Amsterdam. Kopois has brought supplies and furniture to our hideout. In addition, Meep is going to help us, so be brave. Mm -hmm. Friday, June 12th, 1942. You are the nicest present of all. I hope I shall be able to confide in you completely as I never have been able to do in anyone before. And I hope that you will be a great support and comfort to me. I want you to be the true friend for whom I have waited so long. And I'm going to call you Kitty. Because of the anti-Jewish decrees, Daddy can't take the tram like everyone else and has to go to his office at the other end of the city on foot. Ever since the German invasion in 1940, Amsterdam has been occupied by the army, and now we Jews must wear a yellow star on our clothing. If not, we can be arrested. My sister Margot and I have been transferred to the Jewish secondary school. Anyway, I'm so glad to be in the same class with Lise. Uh, I'm not sure, but I'm thinking that. Uh, Anne, you know, everyone is saying you're in love with Harry Goldman. Oh, we've walked to school together once or twice, but that's all. Anyway, that's not what he says. <laughs> 3A minus 6AB plus 5B plus 3A plus Since you seem to be so well informed, tell me what else he's saying about me. Guess that I'm much too young for him? No, he says he prefers you to Fanny, that she puts him to sleep. Hmm, give me that. You're jealous. Just because Harry and I are friends doesn't mean the whole world jealous? has to know. You're joking. He's 16 and he thinks all your friends are children, but he likes you because you're his alarm clock. What? Cool. Is that <laughs> My word, Miss Frank. Uh, why this sudden enthusiasm for algebra? <laughs> That's enough now. Quiet down. Who would like to solve a problem at the blackboard? No volunteers? Why don't we have an expert solve it? Miss Frank? Come on, Come on, go up there. Come on, it's easy. You got it. Yeah, well, she's, she's never been good in math anyway. Oh, maybe she'll help her. Okay. She wasn't listening. <laughs> what do you think she was really talking about? Why do you think she said what? Have you lost your enthusiasm? <laughs> <laughs> uh -oh. Uh -oh. Vacation soon and no oh, more yeah. algebra. Yeah.